Welcome to the HyperMesh 2023 Quick Start for HyperWorks Legacy Professionals video series. It is meant for you, as a proficient user with the HyperWorks Legacy interface, to get efficiently introduced to the new user experience of HyperMesh 2023.0. This is video 4 of 6, introducing to functionality like Find, Distance, Translate and the Vector or Plane definition. Use the tool finder to search for the tools to which legacy panel functionality has been moved. Like to identify where the ruled tool is located now. Use the search field to check for terms from legacy hyperworks and be pointed to their location in ribbons and tools. Like searching for find will bring you to the find entity tool. Find Attached is available in the Find Entity tool, as option, Attached to. Measure is available in the Home ribbon, as well as under the F4 key. Click on a measure, to display its components. Right-click to copy them. Switch to Dimensioning, to adjust distance or angle between two or three nodes. To align and to project are available in the topology ribbon. To reflect or to scale can be found under the switch for the move tool. To position is an option of the move tool itself. The move tool offers the option to translate by the distance between two nodes, like the N2 N1 option from Legacy Hyperworks, through calling the direction tool. The Move tool can be placed and oriented independently of the entities it shall move by holding the Shift button pressed. Then moving the snaps, available at origin and error tips. The Direction tool allows definition of vectors or planes like the N1, N2, N3 selection when you press Ctrl while clicking on entities. Follow chapter number 07 from the HyperWorks 2023 Introduction Exercise videos to get a thorough introduction into the application of the Move and the Direction tools. Often you will find respective buttons to execute or cancel an operation. In the Direction tool you may in some cases need to hit Escape to return to the tool that you called it from, like here in the Extrude tool. Create and populate a custom ribbon by drag and drop to assemble your favorite tools on your own ribbons. You may dock off such ribbons to have them permanently in front view. Alternatively, consider using extensions. Or the tool belt, which can be called with Alt and right click. This concludes the fourth of the six videos of the HyperMesh 2023 Quick Start for HyperWorks Legacy Professionals video series. The next video is about geometry operations. Thanks for watching.